Good morning, friends. Welcome to Friday. Um, I'm actually going to do a little reverse Friday thing here. Um, I am already at work. I just got to work. It's about 10 to 8 right now. On Fridays, I have to be here at 8 o'clock. So I think I told you guys last week that my time has changed Monday through Thursday. So I don't start until 8.30. But on Fridays, I start at 8 o'clock because we're done at noon. So anyway, so I'm at work and I'm just kind of waiting for someone to unlock the door. Yeah. So anyway, what I'm going to do this morning is a little bit of a reverse um, Friday vlog. Um, actually, it's not reverse. I'm actually going to take you back in time. We are going to go ahead and we're going to. I'm going to show you my video from yesterday. Yeah, I started vlogging like yesterday, Thursday, um, because I had a half a day of work. So I thought, well, what the hey, I'm going to go ahead and vlog. So I'm going to share that with you guys today on Friday and then I'm gonna continue my vlog after that so um, yeah so that's what I'm gonna do so you'll probably get like anyway that's what I'm gonna do so this is Friday but today and then now we're gonna go back to yesterday so yay so here we go do 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 hey guys happy Thursday if you guys want to know something like so funny, oh my God. So I'm sitting here at work and of course nobody's here yet. So I'm just kind of sitting here and I'm watching um, the Tim Tracker. I'm watching them. They went to the uh, Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party the other night. If you guys don't um, know who the Tim Tracker is, I suggest that you guys watch them on YouTube, especially if you are Disney fans or fans of Orlando um, because they do a lot of um, like uh, videos on Universal and Orlando Oh, Orlando theme parks. Just let's just cover it that way. Orlando theme parks. So anyway, so I thought I'd like turn on my camera and kind of chit chat with you guys for a few minutes. And I realized I'm like, you know, I'm fixing my hair, or whatever, making sure that I look presentable. And I look over and I'm like, oh, I didn't put any makeup on today. Like none. I didn't. How in the world does that happen? Like I didn't even go sit down. Like my routine is get up, take a shower, get my hair done, go sit down at my makeup table and get my makeup on. I didn't put any lick of makeup on today and I walk I walk out of the house, sit in my car, not even realize it until I just sat here and got to work and turned my camera on right now. However, I did put some lipstick on <laughs> as I was pulling out of the garage today because that's what I always do. I always put on lipstick when I leave the garage. So funny that I didn't even pay a bit of attention to the fact that I didn't even put on any makeup today. So no like mascara, no, no eyeshadow, no eyeliner, no nothing on my face, no foundation, no nothing. What? Oh my God. Okay. Well, I actually probably have a really good reason for it. And I'm just going to start with, I have my in-laws in town. And when I got up this morning, I didn't even take a shower this morning. Um, I didn't feel like I wanted to. So I didn't even take a shower. I didn't wash my hair. I mean, don't freak out guys. I took a shower yesterday, but nonetheless, um, I, and I will shower tonight. Just an FYI. Um, but anyway, so I get up, I get my hair done, I curl it a little bit, wash my face, brush my teeth, do all that normal stuff that people do, you know, if they miss, if they take, don't take a shower in the morning or whatever. I get dressed, and so the first thing that I do is I go into the kitchen and I start, excuse me, and I start preparing dinner for tonight. So I had already had my crock pot out from last, last night, excuse me, and I took all of my, um, uh, my uh, beans and stuff out for my chili. I laid all that stuff out, left the ground beef in the refrigerator, whatever. So I started opening up cans, started putting my stuff in the crock pot. I actually um, sauteed my onions and I browned my ground beef. Um, and I did all of that this morning. Plus I put a load, well, I, I added more dishes to the dishwasher because I loaded it last night, but I wanted to add the rest of the dishes this morning. Turn the dishwasher on. I made up my bed. I mean, seriously, guys, this is why I walked out of the house with no makeup because my morning was just like already, I was already working this morning and I forgot to put makeup on. So it's kind of funny. At least I have lipstick on. Oh, well, 
Anyway, I'm going to get back to watching the Tim Tracker, but I was wanting, that was a whole point of me turning this on for you guys, because I was going to share with you guys that I was sitting here waiting at work, and while I'm sitting here waiting at work, I turned on the Tim Tracker to watch the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, um, and when I did, I'm like, I got scared myself, because I was like, holy crap, Ange forgot to put makeup on this morning, but anyway, <laughs> so that's it. That's how my Thursday started off. How did your Thursday start off? Hello friends, good afternoon on this lovely Thursday afternoon. What? <laughs> anyway, um, so I don't have to work this afternoon. Uh, what a nice surprise. It's That's kind of like a nice little perk there sometimes. But anyway, so yeah, the doctor is off this afternoon, so they close up shop. So yay for me. Um, I do not have to be at work this afternoon. So, I have made arrangements. Sorry, I need to turn that down. Miss Miranda Lambert. Um, so, I have made arrangements for Brian's parents to meet us at O'Charlie's for lunch. And I am going to swing by Brian's work and pick him up so the four of us can have lunch today. And uh, that's kind of a nice little thing because we haven't... We normally get to go to lunch when they're here. That's because I wasn't working before. And now that I'm working, obviously we can't do all that. So uh, anyway, so that's where I'm headed right now. I am headed to go pick up Brian for lunch and then we are gonna go to O'Charlie's. So if you guys are interested in sticking around, please do so. If not, then you guys might wanna catch me on my weekend vlog. Of course, this might be part of my weekend vlog. I don't know. Yeah, this will probably be part of my weekend vlog. I'm just gonna be like starting my weekend. Welcome to the weekend, guys. Cool. Hello friends. So I have finally made it home. I actually went and got my nails done because uh, free afternoon I finally got to get my nails done. I haven't had them done since the week before. Yeah, the week before I think I went to Charleston on the girls trip. Uh. So it's been a long, long time and they were pretty bad. So I finally got them done. I just got them all done black, um, full black this time before it was just the tips black. And then um, my toesies, which I will show you, my toesies are black and orange. So how cute is that? With little Mickey Mouse right there. Anyway, black and orange toesies. Um, this is our dinner tonight. This is my chili which is um, not thick enough, but oh well, it's thick. It looks good. It's thicker than the other stuff was a couple weeks ago. But anyway, this is my chili that's been cooking like all day. And um, I know I had mentioned before about these little bags or whatever. Love those um, little liners for crock pots. It saved so much on cleaning. It was so awesome. I just like whipped out the bag before and threw it away. It was done. So another thing that I wanted to show you guys was, um, I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram or if you follow me on my Facebook page, On The Go With Angie. If you don't, you should go there like now. Um, but anyway, I made my own mini ears yesterday. Oh my gosh, I can't put them on. So anyway, I made my own mini ears yesterday and um, they were so easy and so simple to make that it's like, oh my goodness, look. Okay, can you guys see them at all? There we go. How much, like, is that better? Yeah. So I just bought like these ears at Party City. So you can buy just like the little black ears at Party City. And it already had like um, a red and white polka dot bow on it, which was so ugly. I didn't like it at all. So obviously I just ripped off that bow. And then I just added my own stuff. Like these two little thingies here, I added and then I just added my own like red and white polka dot ribbon. And then with like a green ribbon in the center. So these will be like the Mickey ears. Oh, why can't you see it? These will be the Mickey ears that I wear um, when we are at our at Disney for Christmas. They are like a little loose, so I might have to be re really careful with them when we're riding rides, but I just thought they were so adorable. So I'm like, oh my God, what do you guys think? What? Adorable. And I'm looking at them like in my little thingy there so I can see them too. Oh my God, they're so adorable. And then like on the back of it, um, I just put um, the little green bow. So like when you're walking behind me, you'll be able to see just like the little green bow. How adorably cute is that? So I was super, super happy about those. Love them. They're like my favorite. Ooh, I 
So along with our chili tonight, I made some cornbread um, for it. My mother-in-law actually requested I make some, so I made some cornbread. I have the bowls and the plates laid out. I already have mine scooped out to let it cool off. I already placed a piece of cornbread on my plate. I have kind of like a little set up here. Um, they can shred their own little cheese inside the chili, put some sour cream and some butter for their cornbread and some Fritos if they like that. Some crackers as well if they like that. Here's the spoons and we'll go in the dining room and sit and have dinner. So right now they left to go look at a house or something down the street because um, Brian's parents are thinking about moving here. So I think they just went down the street or whatever to show Brian a, a house or two. But um, anyway, so when they get back, we'll have dinner. Such a nice evening. Love making chili on a cool fall evening. Do you guys like making chili? Let me know. Are you using this as like kindling or something? They charge 75 bucks to take it down to the place off of 81. $32.50 or something like that. That's what it is. Because it cost him 75 or so bucks to do two truckloads. That's what it is. <clears throat> so really that ain't bad, you know? If I could no. get, obviously, these big ones cut up a little bit, I could fit this in that pile there in the uh, say probably at least in a load. truck, no problem. The rest of this stuff will have that burn up. Are you going to build a fire? Hmm? Are you building a fire? That's what I'm doing. Getting all the crap. Oh. Not sure how well this will burn. Right. It's a little too. Wet. It doesn't say it would damp. Are you shoveling this in the wheel? Yeah, that's what I was just going to use the shovel. I'm scared out of it. Now, bear now, bear now, bear now. Green Acres is the place to be. Farm living is the life for me. <laughs> Uh-oh, cricket. You. Did you see us sitting there today at the restaurant? Keith, I think, had a cramp in his side. He was sitting there, and he was like, oh, my God, what's going on? And he scared me. I thought heart attack at first. And he, he thinks maybe it was a cramp. What now? When we were all having lunch? When we got in the cars to leave. Oh, no, I didn't see or no. hear all that. What happened now? He, I think he got a cramp Who? in his, your dad, oh. in his side. Why? Because he could hardly move. Mm. He That's sat there. He got out of the truck. When I got, when I had my kidney stone attack, dude, I thought something internally exploded That's in my body. scared him. I think he didn't know what. Oh, right, mosquitoes. Ah, yes. Our own little campfire. Huh? What? Oh, yeah. Lots and lots of wood. You guys like roasted marshmallows? Or what are these called? How do you roasted marshmallows? Yeah. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. <coughs> so good. Roasted marshmallows. Mmm. Hey guys, so I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog tonight. That way I can get this up tomorrow. You guys can have a Friday video. And then tomorrow night I will start my, or tomorrow, I will start my weekend video for the weekend vlog, the week vlog end. We have quite a few things on our agenda for this weekend, so I'm excited to share all that stuff with you guys. 
Um, now I'm going to go ahead and wash my face and brush my teeth and get myself ready for bed. But I wanted to show you guys some new stuff that I'm using. And I was curious to know if any of you guys have been have used this stuff as well. Uh, I just started using this um, simple um, cleansing micular water. I have no idea how to say that. But anyway, um, I used it for the first time the other night and it was really, really nice and refreshing. So I thought, um, hmm, I wonder if anybody else is using it and what their thoughts are on it. And then along with that, um, I, whoa, oops. <laughs> and along with that, I'm using the, um, the same brand, the Simple Moisturizing Facial Wash. Um, I'm using that as well with this. So um, leave me a comment below. Let me know if you guys have tried the Simple stuff and let me know what you guys think. Um, and then lastly, I'm also using this um, Aveeno uh, positively ageous reconditioning night cream. I've been using this for two nights now and my face has looked pretty clear. Um, I know it's probably like two nights. It's probably nothing, you know, major from two nights, but um, I don't know. It's kind of nice and I like the way it smells and I like the way it makes my skin feel and it makes me feel really nice and fresh. So anyway, so there you have it guys. I will see you guys tomorrow morning or I will see you guys tomorrow on my weekend vlog. For now guys, good night. Thanks for stopping by. Bye.